A blanket pin is a versatile tool that everybody should think about possibly carrying. Now you can replace one of these blacksmith pins with just an oversized safety pin. I feel like these pins are a little bit more robust though for what we're gonna actually use it for. So a blanket pin is just what it says. It holds a blanket together. Now there's a couple different ways you can use this. Today we're gonna talk about how to use it with outerwear. But you can also open up this blanket pin in the pin part, okay, which isn't super, super sharp. Can be sharpened if you'd want to, but you can use this out as an awl um, if it's more robust as this one is. So if you watch a lot of my videos, you know I carry a wool blanket shard with me just about year round. And all the wool blanket shard is, because I got a lot of questions around this, is a twin size wool blanket that I cut in half. And that's it. And I use it a lot for a pillow. I use it to sit on when I'm around camp. Or if it's really cold, I can add it to my covering layer for sleeping. So it's an additional blanket. It's not real big, but it's an, something additional to keep me warm. But really during this season, the fall into early winter, I really like to match up that wool blanket shard with a blanket pin because it gives me an outer layer of clothing in case it gets super cold. And that's very simple. And there's two ways you can do this. You take your shard, you throw it over your shoulders, and this will work fine. You just walk around like this, but the possibility of it falling off, um, you know, increases. So what we do is we take our shard that's around us, we take our blanket pin, we just punch it through both sides like that. We close that pin in and turn it. Now at this point, what happens is it holds on our wool blanket shard and it works really well. I even wear this throughout the winter months because what's good about this is if it starts to get hot, we can open it up like a cape around camp while we're working. We can just drop it back over us like this. So there's a lot of options with that. Another thing you can do in more adverse weather is, and especially with larger blankets, you could take this all the way up over your head, bring it down and make sure when you do this, you have enough coverage in your chest area. Don't uh, just pull the two edges together and try to pin it. Get it good and tight because that's gonna just make it last longer. Again, push that pin through, close it over, rotate it. Now we have a hood that we can wear. Again, if it's raining, some snow, something like that, it's gonna keep the snow off us and keep us more closed in. But the good thing again with this is you can drop that back and you're set. When it gets bad, put your hood up. Can also open up one side open up both sides so it works really well that's a traditional blanket pin i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm going to be selling these on my website too soon so you can go check them out over coldcrackerbushcraft.com in probably about the next week to week and a half and if you have any questions leave them in the comment below and until the next video stay in the woods guys